Hi stampers, it's Elizabeth from StampScrapMore.com and welcome to the Sunday Share. I wanted to really do this last week, but it was really busy getting back to work after on stage, so I'm playing catch up. I'm gonna do a couple of videos to share with you some of the things that we received from on stage and um, kind of my my impression and and um, uh, what it's like to actually attend an on stage live. It's actually awesome. So if you ever get a chance to attend one, especially live, uh, it is really, um, I can't explain it, motivating and inspiring and um, really does give you the strength to continue and to do what you love. So I highly recommend attending a live. And if you can't attend live, the local events are great too. And I'm hoping to be in um, uh, Quebec City in April. So if you, um, want to come to Quebec with with us um, just hit me up and let me know how you can how you can join so one of the things that we received when we um, checked in on Wednesday morning was this box and inside the box it has okay I'm gonna be honest with you it was packed a lot nicer than it is now but uh, you get the idea so we had a stamp set and it's called amazing life and it's photopolymer and it's in the new catalog and there was also a kit um, to put together to make a card using this stamp set. Um, I changed it up a bit and I only did it this morning. So I changed it up. I changed it up. And uh, it's just a small little note card. Happy birthday. And this is using the Stamparatus hinge technique. And I used a variety of different purples. And then with the cake on top. So that was in the bag as well. Or in the box. And there was also three notebooks that we received, journaling notebooks. Well, one of them is uh, lined with the grid paper. The other is lined with um, notes to do and it has like uh, calendar months in there. And then the other is rule lined. So those were the three notebooks. There was also three pens and that was wrapped around the notebook. And there was the bag, and the bag is a muslin bag, and it celebrating the 30th anniversary, and the pocket is um, coordinating colors, and then on the inside, it's actually reversible, and it's got a polka dot pattern to it, and it's got another um, Stampin' Up uh, logo on the inside with with a funky colored pattern on the, with the, yeah, striped pattern on the inside coordinating colors. So that was the, the bag, and that's what we got when we checked in. It's really fun to watch everyone check in, and they're all, everyone's sitting on the carpets in the convention center looking at all their goodies. It's actually a lot of fun to see what, go, what everyone's doing. Also, we checked into, um, after we picked up uh, the bag, we had to go to another section to get, um, no, it was the same section, sorry. It was a separate envelope, though. And um, we picked up sort of an agenda that applies to each person in, person in particular. And um, this is one of the reasons why I really wanted to go to on stage this year um, was because of a few things. One was I because I advanced in title to Silver Elite, thanks to one of my downline who promoted to Silver, I was able to go to Epcot on the Wednesday for the day and we had an amazing time. It was from... They took us from 12.30 to 10 p.m. And at eight, there was there's a little um, uh, building, I guess, uh, that's near the Canadian Pavilion. And they opened up the doors at eight o'clock and they had it set up for a party. And it was a dessert buffet party. And it had all oh, flaming donuts and whiskey. It was awesome with ice cream. And there was macarons and there was refreshments and all these uh, delicious desserts and they had karaoke playing, uh, people singing karaoke and um, it was a great opportunity to mix and mingle. So um, that was center stage. Then the other reason, the other few reasons why I really wanted to attend on stage in Orlando this year, and it was their 30th anniversary, that's the big thing. But I also, because I invite, um, advanced to uh, Silver Elite, I got to march the stage on Friday morning and I also got to uh, march again on Friday morning for earning the 160,000 flex points, which gave me the trip to Greece. And I got to tell you, the 
day uh, October 1st, 2nd, I cashed in those points. As soon as they were in my account, I cashed in those points for the trip. So, and even more awesome was uh, I filled in the registration form last week and on Friday, the flights were booked. And uh, it just, it's so real, I keep pinching myself. So it's a trip for two to Rome, airfare to Rome, and then a cruise um, to the Greek islands for seven days, all inclusive and in tips included. So I am ecstatic. But um, I also got recognition for 10,000 CSVs in a year, um, annual leadership for uh, one to seven team members advancing, and then for recruiting, for having five or more qualified recruits in a year. So it was a pretty awesome event for me and um, I appreciate my team immensely for, um, and my customers for um, giving me this opportunity. So I wanted to share it with you. So along with that, I also received in the package my uh, lanyard, which tells me um, that uh, Elizabeth Green, my demo number, and I'm Canadian. Grapefruit Grove was the name of the room that we were in after on stage, where we went for our make and takes and where we went for lunch each day. They had three, three rooms for it. But, um, so these were the ribbons that I received. And so I got Silver Elite for promoting. Um, I got the center stage, so that means I was able to go to the event at Epcot. Um, my leadership ribbon, my recruiting ribbon, my sales ribbon, and then there is the flex point ribbon, which ultimately gave me the cruise. Anyhow, I, you know, you're going to hear more about that in the coming months, but um, very excited. So that was our lanyard. And I also ordered um, a Stampin' Up! Whoops, I just dropped a bunch of stuff. Um, some Stampin' Up! logo wear. And because my, one of my downline promoted to Silver, which got me to Silver Elite and helped me achieve what I did, um, she, um, I got her one of the Stampin' Up! Um, uh, hoodies. And um, so this is for Catherine. When, you know, she's on vacation now, so when she comes back, that's for her. And then the last thing from check-in day, they had... Um, Stampin' Up! head office uh, folks going around asking questions and giving out prizes. So this was, I earned two and I'm not sure what the questions were, <laughs> to be honest with you. Um, this one is to love what we do and share what we love. It is the uh, share what you love embellishment kit. I haven't even opened it up yet. And then I received a stamp set. So that was day one. That was check-in um, check event on day one and all of the goodies that we received. And um, once I get finished unpacking the rest of it, I will uh, do a quick video to share with you some of the other um, items that we received from, so we received something from Center Stage when we went to Orlando. And we also received, oh, Prize Patrol, yes and all attendee giveaways, which were awesome. Um, so thanks for checking in and have a great day and stay tuned. There'll be another video showing some of the other things that we received. Take care.